Hey guys, Crew of Long Wave back. I'm Calvin. Aaron. Rich. And we are back with another trailer from the Game Awards. This time, a Texas Chainsaw Massacre thing. I've, I've heard that it's been in, like, Dead by Daylight, and it's a, a movie. Sure. What yeah. is this? No, I mean, we watched it. We actually reacted to Texas Chainsaw Massacre, like, a year or two ago. Yeah, yeah. indeed. Um, there, I, I don't know what this is. Uh, there is a uh, Bubba. Bubba Hotep? Huh? That would be great, but no. The the, the, the guy who's in <laughs> Texas Chainsaw Massacre that wears Leatherface, yeah, right? Leatherface. Leatherface. So uh, he's in Dead by Daylight. Um, I don't know if this is gonna be like you play as a killer. There's a Friday the Thirteenth game. To survive it. Yeah, I don't know. If, yeah, I don't know if they're going for that kind of genre or whatnot. But uh, I'm interested to see what the gameplay is going to be I think it could like. be a really good like survival horror, Resident Evil 3 style thing where there's this one unkillable thing you're just running from sure. the entire time. And there's like a family thing like that you're like, sneaking around and stuff. Hmm. And maybe. Kind of like what Resident Evil 7 should have been. Wasn't that what it was? I feel like Better. that's what it was. I feel like that's exactly what it was. <laughs> Let's see what exactly this is. World premiere. Wow, that looks kind of nice. Nice as in, like, it's sunny and bright. I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's fun. That's pretty good. Looks like farming simulator. Uh, the meat grinder. This is not playing like a multiplayer trailer. Like, I would expect a multiplayer trailer to play, you know? Sure. I mean, it could be just a campaign story thing. I just wonder what you play on which side. Is that all they're going to show? Multiplayer. multiplayer horror game based on true events. <laughs> That's... Oh, is that all we're going to show? That's all that we're going to get. Dang, not even a date? <sighs> well, sadly, it feels like it's one of those where, like, the world premiere thing, the idea is like, ah, oh, it's Texas Chainsaw Massacre. So knowing that it's Texas Chainsaw Massacre kind of takes yeah. out of it a little bit. Sure. Because you could be guessing throughout. I yeah. love that they tossed in the Based on True Events thing. Yeah. That's like what the movie did. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, however, I don't quite have the feel of what it's like. So it could be similar to, like, a Dead by Daylight Friday the 13th kind of game then, being, like, a multiplayer horror. Yeah. Um, but is it going to be a... Uh, is it going to be a someone plays a killer multiplayer kind of game? Or is right. it going to be like and we have AI. a few people just being survivors sure. against a yeah, PvE yeah. kind of aspect rather than a PvP kind of aspect? So I was thinking, what if it's like a... Uh, before I said multiplayer, what if you are playing as Leatherface and you have to like choose which victims that you take without arousing too much suspicion? Like So you're like... Agent 47, but you wear their faces? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's interesting, because we got... Friday the 13th, I feel like, was the first one. And then we're getting Evil Dead. Uh, sure, there is an Evil Dead one. And that mm -hmm. one, I think, is a PvE? Or is there someone that plays the bad guy? Someone uh, plays the bad guy? It's like someone plays the bad okay. guy in that one. Uh, and then, like I said, Dead by Daylight has been incorporating a bunch of the sure. horror villains and stuff. And hopefully that doesn't, like... I've been liking Dead by Daylight a lot. Hopefully it doesn't, like... I know Friday the 13th, because of that being out, has hindered if Jason ever gets a chance to be in Dead by Daylight. Sure. So uh, they just recently um, removed Stranger Things due, yeah. to, due to whatever licensing contract they had and stuff. So mm -hmm. um, hopefully they don't have it where they remove Leatherface and some others. So yeah. We'll see. But I, I know that that's become kind of a popular genre as of late. Yeah. Of that. Even Dragon Ball Z is doing Sure, yeah. Where you have, like, here's the one stronger kind of entity where the other ones are trying to work together. To escape. To escape, yeah. yeah. Um, now, in the Friday the 13th one, if you have the right conditions and your team works together, you could sure. kill Jason. Yeah, it was, right. It was possible. Mm -hmm. But uh, it was not very likely. So, no. Given that it doesn't have too much, uh, there's not much to really... No, there's not much. I, I thought they nailed the atmosphere of the trailer. So sure. that makes me have positive... Uh, yeah. Aspirations? <laughs> I don't yeah. think that's what I'm looking for. But it's close. Yeah, I'm it had excited. a good look. It looked just watching that. It's like, oh, it's nice, bright. What are we doing here? And yeah. And all of a sudden, you're just like, we're the meat grinder and a chainsaw. And okay. Indeed. Yeah. So no, maybe it's something to keep our eyes open for and uh, see what we get. There's no release date, not a lot of information, but something they're working on. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, we'll find out more soon. Yep.
guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, make sure you subscribe because we have more stuff that we're going to be covering here from the Game Awards. Make sure that you guys check out twitch.tv slash blindwave. We stream there almost every day. And we also have our official Twitch archive here on YouTube. And you can watch a lot of our old streams right here on, the ch um, on YouTube.